The Nanda Devi National Park or Nanda Devi Biosphere Reserve, established in 1982, is a national park situated around the peak of Nanda Devi meters in the state of Uttarakhand in northern India. The entire park lies at an elevation of more than 3,500 meters feet above mean sea level. The national park was inscribed a World Heritage Site by UNESCO in 1988. The latter was expanded and renamed to Nanda Devi and Valley of Flowers National Parks in 2005. Within the national park lies the Nanda Devi Sanctuary, a glacial basin surrounded by a ring of peaks between 6,000 meters (19,700 feet) and 7,500 meters (24,600 feet) high, and drained by the Rishi Ganga through the Rishi Ganga Gorge, a steep, almost impassable defile. The national park is embedded in the 2,236.74 square kilometers (863.61 square miles) sized Nanda Devi Biosphere Reserve, which, in turn, is encompassed in the 5,148.57 square kilometers (1,987.87 square miles) buffer zone around the Nanda Devi and Valley of Flowers National Parks unit. UNESCO site. Best time to visit Nanda Devi National Park is from May to October. History The first recorded attempt to explore the sanctuary was in 1883 by W. W. Graham, who could proceed only up to Rishi Ganga. Other attempts by explorers in 1870, T. G. Longstaff 1926, 1927 and 1932 Hugh Rutledge did not fetch fruitful results. Eric Shipton and H. W. Tillman entered the inner sanctuary through Rishi Ganga in 1934, thus opening the extensive exploration in the sanctuary. In 1939, the area was declared as a game sanctuary. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Layout of the Nanda Devi Sanctuary. The Nanda Devi Sanctuary within the national park can be divided into two parts, inner and outer. Together, they are surrounded by the main sanctuary wall, which forms a roughly square outline, with high, continuous ridges on the north, east, and south sides. On the west side, less high but still imposing ridges drop from the north and south toward the Rishi Ganga Gorge, which drains the sanctuary towards the west. The inner sanctuary occupies roughly the eastern two thirds of the total area, and contains Nanda Devi itself and the two major glaciers flanking the peak the Uttari north Rishi Glacier and the Dakshini south Rishi Glacier. These are fed by the smaller Uttari Nanda Devi and Dakshini Nanda Devi glaciers respectively. This region was already inhabited by the Aryanich, Mongolian and Himalayan indigenous peoples as per Vedas and natural history but the first recorded entry of the British into the inner sanctuary was by Eric Shipton and H. W. Tillman in 1934, via the Rishi Gorge. The outer sanctuary occupies the western third of the total sanctuary, and is separated from the inner sanctuary by high ridges, through which flows the Rishi Ganga. It is split in two by the Rishi Ganga. On the north side lies the Ramani Glacier, flowing down from the slopes of Dunagiri and Changabang, and on the south lies the Trizal Glacier, flowing from the peak of the same name. This portion of the sanctuary is accessible to the outside, though requiring the crossing of a 4,000 meters (13,000 feet) pass. The first serious climbing expedition to pass through the outer sanctuary was that of T. G. Longstaff, who climbed Trizal I in 1907 via the eponymous glacier. Topic: 
Fauna Common larger mammals are Himalayan musk deer, mainland sero and Himalayan tar. Goral are not found within, but in the vicinity of the park. Carnivores are represented by snow leopard, Himalayan black bear and perhaps also brown bear. Langurs are found within the park, whereas rhesus macaque are known to occur in the neighboring areas of the park. In a scientific expedition in 1993, a total of 114 bird species was recognized. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Flora. Nanda Devi National Park is home to a wide variety of flora. Some 312 floral species that include 17 rare species have been found here. Fir, birch, rhododendron, and juniper are the main flora, it is one of the famous pilgrimages in India. Vegetation is scarce in the inner sanctuary due to the dryness of the conditions. One will not find vegetation near Nanda Devi Glacier. Romani, alpine, prone mosses and lichens are other notable floral species found in Nanda Devi National Park. <laughs> Named peaks of the park and environs <laughs> Within the sanctuary Apart from Nanda Devi, the following peaks lie on ridges dividing the inner and outer sanctuary areas. Nanda Devi, 7,816 meters, 25,643 feet. Devistan I, 2, 6,678 meters, 21,909 feet, 6,529 meters, 21,421 feet. Rishikot, 6,236 meters, 20,459 feet. Topic. On the sanctuary wall These peaks are listed in clockwise order, starting from just north of the Rishi Gorge. Some of them are relatively minor summits and have small topographic prominence, while others are independent peaks. Hanuman, 6,075 meters Dunagiri, 7,066 meters, 23,182 feet. Changebang, 6,864 meters, 22,520 feet. Kalanka, 6,931 meters, 22,740 feet. Rishi Paha, 6,992 meters, 22,940 feet. Mangron, 6,568 meters, 21,549 feet. Dio Damla, 6,620 meters, 21,719 feet. Bamchu, 6,303 meters, 20,679 feet. Sakram, 6,254 meters, 20,518 feet. Latudura, 6,392 meters, 20,971 feet. Sunanda Devi, 7,434 meters, 24,390 feet. Nanda Cat, 6,611 meters, 21,690 feet. Panwali Doar or Panwali Dwar, 6,663 meters, 21,860 feet. 
Mike Toley, 6,803 meters, 22,320 feet. Dev Tilly, 6,788 meters, 22,270 feet. Imrigthuni, 6,855 meters, 22,490 feet. Trizal I, 2, 3, 7,120 meters, 23,360 feet, 6,690 meters, 21,949 feet, 6,008 meters, 19,711 feet. Bethatoli Himmel, 6,352 meters, 20,840 feet. Topic Just outside the wall. The following are the most notable peaks which are adjacent to the wall, they are all connected to the wall by high passes. They lie just outside the boundaries of the park. Hardale, 7,151 meters, 23,461 feet, northeast corner. Trishuli, 7,074 meters, 23,209 feet, just beyond Hardale. Nandakot, 6,861 meters, 22,510 feet, southeast corner. Nanda Gunti, 6,309 meters, 20,699 feet, southwest corner. Topic: Nuclear-powered spying device on Nanda Devi. During the Cold War era when Chinese carried out their first nuclear test in 1964 and followed it up with missile testing, the US and India actively collaborated to spy on China's nuclear capabilities. Before the advent of spy satellites much of the clandestine intelligence gathering relied on ground-based sensors. The Chinese missile testing facility was north of the Himalayan range which was a big hurdle in picking missile telemetry signals. CIA was looking for a Himalayan peak high enough to secure a direct line of sight to the Chinese missile testing zone. Together with the Intelligence Bureau of India, they planned a secret mission to install a nuclear-powered listening device on top of the peak of Nanda Devi. A joint team of CIA hired U.S. mountaineers together with Indian contingent from the Defence Forces were detailed to carry out the secret mission. By that time the mountaineering season was concluding and the mission met with adverse climatic conditions. They left behind the plutonium-fueled device with the intention of renewing their attempt during the next year's climbing season. The follow-up Indian expedition during the next season found the device missing from where it was anchored. Probably fell down due to rock fall and slid towards the glaciers carrying its plutonium with it. All the follow-up secret expeditions launched to retrieve the device met with failure. Recently, the tourism minister of Uttarakhand state Mr. Satpal Maharaj met the Prime Minister of India to express his apprehensions that the atomic device that had gone missing over 50 years ago might be polluting waters of the Ganges. See also Indian Council of Forestry Research and Education